In this Quiller tutorial, I will be explaining how to use block groups. To begin, I'm going to select blocks in my quilt using multi-block select. Next, I'm going to go into the design center, and I want to use one of my imported blocks. I'm going to select pinwheel, then at the bottom, I'm going to use block grouping. Here, I'm going to give my block group a name, so I'm going to name this block group pinwheel. I'll select create grouping, hit OK, and then done. And I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to select blocks on my quilt using multi-block select. And I'll go back into the design center. And here I'm going to choose a different imported block. I'm going to select block grouping. And I'll give this block group the name butterfly. I'll select create grouping. Hit OK and then done. And now let's say I get to this point and I don't like the butterfly block that I selected. I'm going to swipe over to block groups. Swipe up to butterfly and hit select. Now all of my butterfly blocks are selected and I'm going to go into the design center and choose a different butterfly block. And I'm going to select done. And because I used block groups, I was easily able to change out the old butterfly block to this new butterfly block, which looks a lot better. And that is how you use block groups.